Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Steph and today I'm going to react to Dragon Ball Super episode 97 and 98. So last episode we just basically got over like the Frieza rampage basically. Goku and him were basically able to fight off the ambush and you know he got brought back to Capsicorp, reunited with everybody as... <laughs> oy. Of course him and Vegeta had to uh, be salty towards each other, which I don't blame them but it's also very funny to see. But we left off with everybody arriving at the ring finally. We got a look at every single universe's fighters I guess you can say. and that's where we left off. So for the rest of the episodes and the rest of the freaking saga is just gonna be about this fight. It's just a matter of, you know, who wins and who loses now. And like I said at the end of my last video, I feel like the universes that are gonna be focused on the most is gonna be obviously six and seven, cause six, we already have a relationship with them. We've already seen them before. And it's gonna be universe 11 because you know, there's Jiren and Top in it and you know, they've been teasing them for a while. And it's probably gonna be a little bit more of universe nine because we've already seen them too. And they've been focusing on them a lot, being like, you know, little shitheads and like, kind of like being snakes and trying to like, I guess you can say sabotage other universes underneath like, you know, the radar. But every other universe, I feel like they're just there for play. Lot. they're not gonna really play a huge role they're kind of you know gonna get eliminated first but for now let's see who gets eliminated first and let's see how this thing starts if you guys are enjoying my dragon ball super series so far and you guys want to see always uncut reactions early make sure to check out my patreon link will be in the description without further ado it's gonna be dragon ball super episode 97 and 98 let's go Hey everyone, just want to give a special thanks and a shout out to my Patreons for supporting me. Over on my Patreon, you'll gain early access to all of my uncut reactions on top of other perks. Check out my Patreon, the link is in the description. Survive! The Tournament of Power begins at last. Finally! Yeah, that's what I would do if I was in this situation. Just survive. Let everyone else eliminate each other first. Save your energy if you can. Like if someone attacks you, obviously fight them. But don't start a fight and save your energy until you get down to the final few and then you can fight. That's what I do. Wow. See, they only focused on a few. See? Six, seven, and eleven were the three that they focused on. I think there were one other, but... See? Everyone else is just there for plot. The competition will last 100 tacks. The column in the center will descend as time elapses. Okay. And once it reaches the ground, all fighting will officially conclude. Uh, what's 100 tacks? I think it's roughly equivalent to 48 Earth minutes. Special techniques are allowed, but the use of weapons is prohibited, as are any lethal attacks or maneuvers. However, you may force your opponents off the ring, and must do so to win. For even if someone is rendered unable to fight, they will not be eliminated unless they're out of bounds. So you gotta throw their unconscious body out of the ring. Energy-based flight techniques that would prevent you from falling will not be accessible to you here. However, those of you who possess wing-like appendages so yeah, they can will fly. Be able to fly. Damn! Clip the wings, bro! We're gonna follow the Supreme Kai's Look advice. how tiny he is. We'll stick together and work as one unified team, got it? We should start out forming a circle with our backs to each other, and no matter what, we'll take him on in groups of two or more. Nobody fights alone. Okay. <laughs> a cowardly strategy. Well, I shall take it under advisement for now. Oh, that's just perfect. All this palpable bloodlust I sense in the air is refreshing. Truly a salve for the soul after all those wretched fairies and teddy bears. Go, Universe 7! You can do it! I want to see teamwork! Alrighty, cheerleader Beerus. <laughs> Come on! I don't believe my ears! How pathetic to hear you spouting off about teamwork, Beerus! <sighs> How much you want to bet his universe is going to be the first out? At last, Grand Zinos, it is time to begin. Are we ready? Yes, hurry! Alrighty, I'm so ready for this. Let's fucking go. I've been waiting for this. <laughs> Damn. How can you see what's happening? Oh my god, these things are freaking sadists, bro. Jesus. They just like enjoy violence. Hey, come on, top. Let's go. You and me right now. Oh god. Oh shit. What happened to teamwork, dad? 
bad that you completely forget about our strategy? Huh? Oh god. Oh, no, on, no. You too. There we go. All right, Frieza. If everyone else is having fun, I might as well partake. <laughs> what the? We had a plan. Don't worry about it, Gohan. It's not like we didn't see it coming with so many egos. Why did we yeah. even bother devising a strategy? Yeah. Oh, good grief. What a mess. These mortals will be the death of me. <laughs> Literally. Yeah. This man's stress levels are so high. Poor guy. <laughs> Damn. Attack That's rude. Even have a chance to transform, which is not beautiful at all. <laughs> Damn. Moves, a dirty trick. And why the heck did we think of that? <laughs> What's he? The third, I think. Take out his arms. Like, knock him on his ass. Jesus. Never mind. All right. Hit's got it, man. Whoa, nice hit, hit. That's how you do it. <laughs> oh, Basil. <laughs> Bravo! Excellent work, Basil! Yeah, take out his arms. That's the thing that was knocking everybody out. Plus one. Wow. Yeah, that's our kicking Basil. Wait. So she's go. the first out. Did she just fall to her death? Oh, she just spawns there. Okay. Well, shit, she's the first out. So that's what happens. When you fall out of the ring, you get transported back over to the spectator seats. Okay. Contestant Ryla Bue of the 10th Universe has been swiftly eliminated. She's gone, huh? Hey, let me do the next one. Oogie doogie. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I'm not surprised that she got eliminated first. I feel like the 10th Universe is one of the weakest, too. I'm kind of surprised they ranked higher than 9 and 7. Because... What I saw from their, you know, fighters are just fairies and shit. And we just saw one of their teammates get eliminated and they were the first. That's not the greatest. But honestly, I feel I feel so bad for Gohan, man. If anything, I would talk to the people who actually have common sense or something and want to build a team and just forget about the rest. Forget Goku, Vegeta, Frieza, Seventeen. They're just gonna go off and do their own thing. And to be honest, if I was Gohan, I wouldn't really worry about them because they're pretty powerful and they're pretty smart and know what they're doing. But everyone else, like, you know, Tien, Roshi, Piccolo, I would keep them in the group and just like you know follow their plan but yeah honestly like i said what i would do i would just focus on survival don't go looking for a fight like goku's doing if they come at you then fight them but like don't go looking for a fight try to stay out of view if that's possible survive until the end and then it'll just be narrowed down to the strongest fighters and then you can fight that's what i do when i play fortnite man i get my loot i stay by myself if someone comes up and tries to shoot me i shoot them and then i just like wait it out until like you know the final whatever four or whatever final five final ten whatever and then that's when i start actually like fighting and stuff dude let's Beautiful. fucking go let's fucking go man <laughs> yeah, I Let's fucking go, you guys. Oh my god. I don't know. That's just me. But it looks like, you know, Goku, Vegeta, Frieza, they're gonna go looking for some fun, man. But for now, let's see who's gonna be eliminated next. I'm so ashamed of myself. As well you should be. Damn. Tommy, what do you think your wings are for if not to stop you from falling? I'm really sorry. It just happened so fast. Yeah, I was about to say, why couldn't she just fly? Hey, listen! Nobody from Universe 7 drops out, got it? Yo, 6th Universe! Hurry up and knock the 7th out! Oh my Everyone god! Fucking Chompa. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, they're definitely brothers. Fucking Chompa, that timing was perfect. We meet again, Saiyan. Only this time it isn't gonna end in a draw. <laughs> Flare! Blind them all. Now knock them out. Knock them out, man. Fucking roid it up, man. Nade strings back. 
The bear is probably one of the easiest to defeat because he's so heavy. Just do exactly what Goku did. Tip him over and just throw him out. Can he do anything besides kick? Like, come on, throw a punch. Like, I know he's known as the kicker, but still. Is he gonna eliminate this guy? Looks like he's pushing him out. Yeah. Almost. All right, Nepapa. Way to hang in there. <laughs> All right, 17, let's go. Or 18. And Vegeta. Justice Flash! Yo, top. Oh, go for again. Again. Ooh. Oh. Oh. I think that's that Jiren guy. No shit. Whoa, you see that one? Looky, looky. Ah! <laughs> Never mind. Jiren hasn't moved a muscle yet. Yeah, nor would I expect him to. That's kind of his shtick, the whole stoic thing. Hmm, him and Hit better get along. Or would get along if they weren't in this position, probably. Give off very similar vibes. Oh no, Goku! For goodness sake, he dropped his guard again? That boy'll never learn. <laughs> oh shit, it, bite him. You were in this position before, bite him. I'm gonna toss him out, yeah. Crazy? You're gonna fall out too, you know? Oh, that's okay. As long as I got my strong little buddy with me. Oh great, he's diving over the edge and taking Goku. Not a bad way to take out another team's best fighter. That is pretty smart, but what's Goku gonna do? You can go there, no mind yourself. Damn. Oh, shit. That didn't work out. Goku? Did Goku fall out? No, he did not. Oh, he's on the edge. Contestant Nink of the fourth universe has officially been eliminated. Okay, so I feel like 10 and 4 are gonna go first. I wonder what the first, or uh, uh, what universe is gonna be first to go. I feel like it's 10. I feel like 10's the weakest. Didn't think it was going to be this much fun. <laughs> With the fate of eight universes hanging in the balance, the Tournament of Power is at last underway. Which contestant will be the next to fall, Beerus. putting their universe one step closer to elimination? And in the end, who will be the last warrior standing? The Tournament of Power has only just begun. 47 Earth minutes remain. That was until one time minute? Is up. Hell Next no. Time on Dragon Ball Super. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we are just getting started with this tournament, man. We already have two opponents out. And yeah, like I said, I feel like all the other universes that we haven't been focusing on are going to be eliminated first. I just wonder which one's going to be first. My guess is going to be the 10th, probably. It's either the 10th or the 3rd. But out of the four that I was talking about, like 6, 7, 11, and 9, I feel like out of those, nine will be the first to go then obviously it's going to probably be six and then it's going to be down to the seven and you know eleven one with goku and jiren but one minute has passed damn bro i feel like every single episode is going to be one minute then honestly maybe two or three minutes or something like that if they're going at this pace because this is episode i believe like what 98 or something i forgot what i said and there's like what 130 episodes of the saga so we got like a good 30 ish episodes after this so i feel like each episode is going to be equal to like one to maybe three minutes in like the universe thing but alrighty, so for now let's see who's next to be eliminated ah the uncertainty a universe despairs. <laughs> oh, poor Goku. You may have narrowly survived Ning's attack, but you're about to wish you hadn't. I was hoping to express my gratitude for instigating this whole affair, but I never expected the opportunity to arise so early. Hey, I'm just glad I finally get the chance to fight you guys again. Especially for Gamma. Mm -hmm. I've been working out pretty hard since our last fight, so you'll have even more power to borrow from me now. That's funny. You can act cocky if you want, but let's see how smug you are when we show you what we're really made of. If they do manage to take him out, then there's pretty much no way the Seventh Universe can win. 
So I'll certainly be rooting my heart out for those three mutts. Damn. <laughs> Damn, backstabbing his brother. Hey, listen, Goku. You understand how this works, don't you? You don't need to have a long fight with them. Just shove them out of the ring. Don't waste all your energy showboating with these furry nobodies. I know, Damn. Paris. I'm just warming up. <laughs> yeah, is he allowed to use the poison? You remember the poison I used to debilitate your son? Well, that was just a kid's portion compared to the huge help. I feel like Lavender might accidentally poison his brothers <laughs> instead of Goku. And that's how Goku gets out of this. Oh, good hit. Poison is serious business. Oh. He made a barrier. Hey, why nice. is my poison working? Okay. You shouldn't have shown us your technique at the expo. After that, me and Gohan put our heads together and figured out the perfect antidote. Nice. That was smart. My, my, my. Goku certainly seems to be enjoying himself over there. And perhaps I ought to follow suit. After all, I should make every second of this reprieve count. You're all mine! Clipped his wings. Now he can't fly. Congratulations, my flightless friend. Now I'm going to make you my new plaything. <laughs> Fucking Frieza, man. I wonder if Frieza's gonna help him out to face the wolves. The ferocious trio of danger. He has a stupid name. We've always had to work together and guard each other. Something tells me that Lavender might accidentally poison his brothers. If one of us couldn't stop a foe on our own, if they're not the immune to it, would team up and destroy them with a powerful combination. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! A coordinated siege from three sides. Goku appears to be facing quite the uphill battle. Who's gonna help him? Someone's gonna help Goku. I feel like it might be Frieza. There is no escaping from the trio of danger's ultimate combo. The unbreakable three-sided attack! Or as I call it, the Danger's Triangle! Danger's Triangle! My favorite triangle! Whoa! My goodness. Danger's Triangle. A rather silly name for an otherwise impressive tactic. They're just shaming the names, bro. Where's Vegeta gonna help him? Damn it, Kakarot. Someone's gonna help him. I wonder if it's gonna be both Vegeta and Frieza. Even the odds. Yeah, he's not doing too well. He needs help. <laughs> Bravo! Hang in there, doggies! Chapa's a bitch, bro. Just praying on your downfall. Yep. Oh, Kakarot, what are you doing wasting your time playing with puppies? Hey, these ninth universe guys aren't the easiest to deal with. Yeah, Vegeta starters, never fought them. Possible to sense their energy. And when they gang up on you, it can get a little challenging. Ha! Could you excuse me more lame? If it's so hard, sit this out. I'll tame these mutts. Hey, Damn. no fair, Vegeta. I was here first! Is Frieza gonna join too? Warriors of the Ninth Universe, join forces and drive those imbeciles out of the ring! Make them pay! Finally, our turn to have fun. <laughs> uh, isn't the rest of the Ninth? Not to worry, Supreme Kai. Your yeah. wish is our demand. Alrighty, who's gonna help Vegeta and Goku? Alright, so this is not looking good for Vegeta and Goku, man. Now the entire ninth universe is teaming up against them. They did show Frieza, so I wonder if Frieza's gonna make, like, you know, a heroic grand entrance to save them. Because Frieza has to be so fucking extra. And he'll help out Vegeta and Goku. Because I feel like everyone else is still preoccupied with their own fights, but, you know, Vegeta and Frieza. Frieza's Frieza. And even though he hates helping out Goku, he still will help him out. Especially what the stakes are. And I'm really surprised how Beerus isn't saying any shit back to Champa, even though Champa is literally preying on their downfall. Nobody else, just Beerus's universe. That's how you know they're siblings. But I feel like once, like, you know, Goku, Vegeta pull this off, Beerus is gonna turn over and be like, you were saying? What were you saying again? Honestly, the bickering between them is just hysterical. But for now, let's see how Vegeta and Goku handle this situation, and let's see if Frieza steps in. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha 
So that means we get four apiece, right, Vegeta? Screw that! First come, first serve! You're fair! Oh, Vegeta. He doesn't know the barrier thing. So I wonder if he's gonna get poisoned. No way! You're facing me! Oh, there we go, okay. Well, at least those two managed to bust up that dangerous whatever the heck it's called. Triangle! Try to keep up! It doesn't matter, Beerus. Vegeta! You gotta watch out for that one's poison! I don't need a babysitter, Kakarot! I know how to fight him! Oh, he can do the barrier, too. He cut him? I just barely missed. Oh, he missed. I'm not gonna let you dodge me a second time. Too bad I have to tear that pretty face of yours to shreds! Go to hell! Come on, see it! Please, not my pretty face! Surprise! Oh! Yeah, who's gonna help him? They can't do this on their own. Someone else has to help him. Just give up, Goku. You have no chance of winning. <laughs> Is Frieza gonna help him? Come on, I'm waiting for yeah, Frieza. Yeah, we'll see about that. Goku and Vegeta are starting to lose ground. Way to go, Universe 9! You're doing great! Now hurry and knock those clowns out of the ring! You can do it! Jump <laughs> There we go. You jump? What are you doing? It's not even your universe! Why wouldn't I cheer? Think about it! If they get Goku and Vegeta, there'll be nothing left of your seventh but the B-team! Those ninth universe Cretans are up to something. Hmm. I just can't put my finger on it. Winning, losing, it's all a matter of luck. He who seizes the chance at the right moment will be victorious. Oh, oh damn. Oh shit. What in the that's not good. Ah, so that's what that lunkhead was up to. How's that for a technique? Ice of ice lances are absolute zero! Frostbite. Watch your frostbite, dude. I don't even know if Saiyans can get frostbite, but still. Here I go! So fast he's my brain! Get out of the way. Let them each other knock each other out. Exactly. Oh no! Lavender! Huh? There's the opening I've been waiting for. Kick him out. And knock him out. Wait until they get distracted. Oh yeah, he has an ice fist, so it doesn't hurt him. It's probably harder. What just happened? They tried to seize an opportune moment for victory. But then, after freezing Vegeta's hand, they became selfish. With two trying to claim the triumph for themselves, they went from coordinated moves to opposing strikes. Vegeta, of course, took advantage of the brief mistake. Never underestimate the great power of Prince Vegeta! Prince Vegeta! <laughs> the Prince of Two Saiyans, man. <laughs> or according to Frieza, Prince of No One. Damn, they're gone. Wow. wow. They're dropping so fast now. Yes, very fast. Okay, maybe the ninth is gonna be first. That is a lot. <sighs> Wait, six? Yeah, I got taken out too. Uh, Damn. <laughs> so now it's just the wolves that are left. What's the matter, plaything? Are you not having fun yet? Because I do have some more games we could try. Oh my god, <laughs> it's cat and mouse, man. <laughs> Please! He's just gonna run. He's just gonna run off. He didn't want to do I'm the finally thing. safe. Have you gone mad? If our team loses, we all die, including you! Uh, Frieza scared the bitch so much, he'd rather die. <laughs> Alright, so it's just the brothers. Yeah, maybe the ninth is the first to go. Wow, I didn't expect that. Damn. Alright, brothers! Triangle! Danger! Kamehameha and Galagun. Fine. There we go. Final flash. Yeah. It's gonna push him out. It's gonna overpower them. Yeah. Yep. Wow, so the ninth is done. Let's see how they get destroyed. Shit, that's it. Okay, how do they get destroyed now? That's all ten of our fighters. Eliminated. This can't be. What's to become of the Ninth Universe now? Nothing. All warriors of the Ninth Universe have been thrown from the ring. Their team has been defeated. By the rules laid forth, 
Universe 9 of the cosmos will be obliterated at once. Francino! No! Bye-bye! <laughs> Oh my gosh. Hmm. And he's smiling. They just vanished. This took a this took a turn. This is no friendly competition. Uh. And the Omni Kings do not bluff. Every team that loses will have their universe destroyed. Can Goku and his allies and the rest of the seventh universe last through the end of the tournament? And the angel's or the last they one, be yeah. Lost too in this dreadful and he doesn't game. fucking care. Wow. The battle for survival continues next time on Dragon Ball Super. Well, that took a dark turn fast. All right, and that was episode 97 and 98 of Dragon Ball Super. Wow, okay, so we're only a few episodes into the tournament, and we've already got the, our first universe eliminated. And it was actually the ninth. I'm kind of surprised, but not surprised at the same time. I'm not surprised because they were deemed the weakest out of, like, what, the 12? But I'm also surprised because we've been focusing a lot on them, so I thought they would stick around a little bit longer, and then it would eliminate the other universes that we haven't really seen much of. But, uh, wow, that moment when they were, like, you know, the, when the moment hit, that, you know, everyone was eliminated and the universe is just gone. Wow, that hit differently a little bit. I almost felt sorry for the ninth universe, actually. I was like, oh my god, like, this is for real, man. It's kind of almost making me feel like I'm in this universe or in this situation myself, and I'm seeing it right before my fucking eyes that, like, you know, shit can just disappear in any second. Wow, that's crazy. Okay, so who is next to be eliminated? I think it might be ten. Because ten already has one of them out, and I think three also has one of them out. But, okay, so since the ninth is out, I feel like the last three universes are going to be the 6, 7, and 11. Everyone else is going to go, I just don't know which order. I feel like the tenth is going to go first, but uh, damn. Wow, okay. And I absolutely love how Frieza freaked that one guy out so much that he actually hopped over the edge willingly and completely forgot what the consequences are to that rather than staying on the damn thing and trying to fight Frieza. That's the impression that Frieza leaves on you, man. Fucking hilarious. I feel like Frieza's gonna be one of the last ones to be eliminated. But okay, so for next episode, we're just gonna continue the tournament and let's see who else faces Universe 7. I feel like we're gonna take a break and not really focus on Universe 11. 11 until like the very end we might see like you know the non like you know relevant people fight like everyone else except for the ones that we've seen like top jiren dispo i feel like those three are gonna hang out you know just like stay out of the way and we're not gonna see them fight until like the very end or closer to the end but we're gonna focus mainly on like the other universes get them out of the way and then start focusing on the ones that really matter but until next time if you guys are enjoying my dragon ball super series so far and you guys want to see all these uncut reactions early make sure to check out my patreon link will be in the description also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for future reactions. And again, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.